Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of, well, mostly cloudy Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, I have most of the U.S. indices trading the upside. The one that is not is the Dow transports are off 23 points, about two tenths of a percent. To the downside, the Dow is up uh, almost two tenths, uh, 46 points. Same with the S&P, six points. The Nasdaq up 21. The Russell's up 13. That's a big winner. Winner chicken dinner. Gold's up nine, ten bucks. Uh, silver's up 11 pennies. Lights recruit up 71 cents. 119.20 is the print there. Natural gas is uh, basically flat. Up slightly, a 30-year treasury up 1.3 ticks. She's trading at 137.24. Let's go spend a little time, take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We just got to get to the right tab. Here we go. So if we take a look at the ES Mini uh, trading right into resistance, resistance being a descending trend line. If price can get through that, the next resistance level is going to be uh, where? That's a great question. It's really trend line resistance that it's dealing with. Uh, if price can get above those trend lines, it could make a run for 43.54. That's not our call as we're speaking just yet. But as long as that spot volatility continues to move lower, and it could target the uh, bottom of that Bollinger Band rating to 21.94. If that comes to fruition, then we should see the ES Mini continue to move higher. The NASDAQ, NQ, uh, it did form that new profile. We talked about that yesterday. Price is just consolidating in between those levels. That's at 12.308 as support and 12.945 for resistance. If you take a look at the U.S. dollar index, um, it's right now trading in the resistance of the top of its profile. This one that formed last week, 102.30. We're trading at 102.23. So watch those levels. You've got gold moving higher. Its resistance level right now is the center of its weekly profile. And that's at the 1857.20 area. Price can get above that, then it run to 1879. The real key resistance level for silver still is the center of its bear structured weekly profile. And that level is 22.26. Lights recruit. Forming a new bear structured daily profile, but price really hasn't done a whole lot out here. But support would be 113.49 and resistance 120. I can't really read. Uh, 120.99. Natural gas has a TD9 count that is still in place, but it would be negated. And if it gets negated, it tells you about a strong upward momentum move. And that would require a close of $9.43. The 30 year treasury finding support at the bottom of its weekly profile. That's at the 138.01. Yeah, 138.01. We're trading at 138.27. Folks, do me a favor. Stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show. But if you're off to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. And we look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care.